FPS. So when I cut the camera off, now it's gonna flip up. God is great. Is it that simple? God is great. Don't get no simpler than that, bro. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy D Frank, man. Welcome back to God and Guns, bro. And today, 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 I pray that everybody feeling as blessed and highly favored as I am. Like, comment, and subscribe. I gotta start saying that because they got me shadow banned right now. So I'm not really in the algorithm at all, but we're gonna get back into it. Oh man, y'all know I got the AR, bro. I finally went ahead and copped that AR. You know what I'm saying? As you guys can see, I recently put some flip up sights on her. And for those of you who don't know, I'm finally gonna go ahead and give the whole backstory of the AR. Well, not the backstory, but like my inspiration of it. I'm gonna go ahead and put the commando from the Black Ops 1 right here. Basically, the commando from Black Ops 1 was basically an ARP, right? So, with that being said, I thought about just buying the ARP, making the commando, the exact commando from Black Ops. Then I seen there was a few people on YouTube who had one. So, I was like, man, what can I do to be different? You know, something a little different, but not too crazy. You know what I'm saying? So, I was like, why don't I try to make a full size? Full size. I bit my tongue recently, too. So, I've been, my list been even worse than whatever it is. A full size AR-15, aka a full size commando, right? You know, 16 inch barrel commando. So that's my um, inspiration behind it. So if you guys don't know, um, I do this series called Building on the Budget, one that you're watching right now. So where I get decent, you know, not even decent, really good quality products for a very cheap price. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, for those of you who don't know, I got this optic. This is the Siley Calf X1. I have that on my focus focus it's not focusing because i got it in cinematic mode new camera by the way but we're back it's not going to focus on i don't think it's going to focus let me see y'all see that new camera man y'all see what that new camera can do man stop playing with me man but god is good god is good god is good all glory to god but you know i got that Sally calf x1 right here from Sally. but today we're going to be going over the big boys this is the, the micro uh, package, and this is the Siley T10 red dot package. I haven't even opened it yet, bro, but I'm really excited, as you guys can see. Hey, I'm feeling that new camera. Stop playing, man. I ain't gonna lie, stop playing. I'm feeling that new camera. Yeah, I had to go ahead and put my hair up because they kept messing with the audio, kept hitting the microphone. But we're back, man. Like I said, you guys can see the sizes, the different in sizes of these packages. This is, like I said, the other one. But we're gonna go ahead and get right into the T10, man, which is a very good optic from what I'm seeing. Very good reviews on Amazon. I just like the solid company as a whole, bro. I really do. Oh, and as soon as you open up, she's on the box. Box is super, super heavy compared to the other one, but let's go ahead and get this thumbnail. Okay, so we got the thumbnail, man. And as you guys can see, like I said, compared to this box, and it's not a comparison. It's probably my last time picking this up. But I just want you guys to see how much bigger this box is. This T10 looks amazing, man. Now, I was going to get the Romeo Sig 5. What is it called? Sig P5? Romeo Sig 5. I'm going to go ahead and put it up here. I was about to get that one. But I couldn't find any information as if it was shake or or not. And I think I might have finally got my answer. Somebody said it wasn't. Now, that could be wrong. But that's why I didn't get it. But I know that this is shake awake and for those of you who don't know what shake awake is shake awake is a feature to where if i sit down my my optic right my gun obviously the optic is on the gun i sit it somewhere within four minutes it's going to completely shut off and it's not going to drain the battery it's not going to be using battery because it's off that's something to where i really enjoy because on my red dot on my pistol the um other one i have that same feature on that red dot and I keep my red dot to the highest setting as possible just because I like that bright, bright, bright red light. And it took a long time before that battery decided to die. For the first time together, this is a two MOA dot. You know what I'm saying? So two MOA dot right there, as you can see. Yeah, she's definitely focusing on now. I love this new camera, man. So let's go ahead and look at it together. Hopefully she don't fall out. 
I'm ready to start phone pen. Okay. Obviously, we're not looking at that. Little microfiber towel, man. You know what I'm saying? Definitely need that. I got a few of those now at this point, but okay, so sticker. Let's get past that. Okay, so I had it upside down. This is how she comes. You know what I'm saying? This is how she comes. She's nice, bro. She's really, really nice. I like that. Um, as you can see, we have a a short mount, a, a low mount, I meant to say. In case you want to have it low, but I want mine high, so I got this. Um optic, like I said, because it came with a high sitting mount, which I really, really want to have to kind of mimic that uh commando, like I said, man. I'm gonna talk more about that soon, but this is how she looked. Let's go ahead and get out. And off the rip, before I even pull out off the rip, you can just feel that she's good quality. Really good quality. Really, really heavy optic, man. This is how she look in the hand, man. She's very good. She got these covers over her. I'm going to go ahead and take these covers off, which is a nice quality, bro. Not going to lie. Not going to lie. Is she on at all? No, she's not on. So, yeah, man. I'm not going to lie. I know, I know absolutely nothing about... Uh, Oh, that is so fine. Yeah, I'm sorry I'm gonna keep doing that. But now I know absolutely absolutely nothing about big red dot. So I'm about to read this manual and I'll be back with y'all, man. But this is how she looked. I think you look through this window, if I'm not mistaken. But look how big that window is. Look at how big that window is. I'm gonna wipe it down too because I keep touching her. But I'm gonna go ahead and read the manual. I'm back up with my bad. I'm gonna go ahead and read the manual and get back with y'all, man. Give me a little minute. Okay, so I'm back, fellas. And from what I read so far, it's pretty basic, a pretty basic installation. And it comes with a battery. It's a, I didn't even look at it. I just almost put it out. It is a, okay, a standard um, 2032 battery. I wish it was the same battery that comes in that other one because I bought those batteries in bulk in case I ran out. But I can just go ahead and order some of these off of Amazon. You know what I'm saying? Standard um, 2032CR battery. But from what I'm gathering is, all you do is unscrew this. Okay. All you do is unscrew that. Comes right off. You know what I'm saying? You guys can see. Comes right off. Man, this is really good quality. I can't stop. I can't stop showing you guys how it looks because it's really, really good quality. But I'm going to go ahead and um, open up this battery right quick. How y'all doing today? How y'all mental, fellas? I'm all up in the camera and stuff, man. I got to get used to this good camera. I've been using that other camera, which was good to me until I got this one. But how y'all been, man? Y'all boys mental been good? Leave a comment below. Let me know how y'all feeling. I'm supposed to be off today. But you know, when I'm doing YouTube, this don't feel like a job. So I'm enjoying it, man. I guess you place it. Yeah, you should place it upside up like that, right? Go ahead and screw it on. And you want to make sure she's all the way on. Okay, so I went ahead and, and tightened it up with my hand. But I am going to take like a screwdriver. As you can see, it got like a little groove in there. You can use a screwdriver to really tighten it. I really want to make sure I tighten it. And the dot is on, ladies and gentlemen. Now, for what I'm reading, let me make sure. It also comes with a lifetime warranty, which is perfect. You know what I'm saying? The site has 10 illumination settings, eight daytime and two night. Dang, it got a night vision setting? That's pretty cool. I didn't even know that. But I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys once again how big this window is. You see what I'm saying? Look how big that one. Look at look at how clear that is, that dot. Look how nice that dot is. Let's see if I can. Let me see. Okay. See how low it is? Hope you guys can see that. That dot is low right now. So I think this is the lowest one to go. Then it go all the way up to right there. That's really, really bright. That is really bright, man. But that is nice. I know you guys are probably ready. Oh, also to zero it in, right? It's actual. Wait, can you unscrew it? Oh, this comes off. What the heck? Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Now, to zero this in, unlike most red dots for pistols, most micro red dots, you zero this in, right? With like the little tool it come with, which is right here, I think. 
No, it's not the tool. So how you do it move? Now, okay, I want to be fully transparent with y'all. I did um notice that they had like the groove on top, like I said. Yeah, right there. I think you probably can use any type of screwdriver, but I would have thought it would have came with one of these. This is the same one that came with my micro red dot. So um I'm using this, you guys can hear. Wait, bring it closer here. See how it's moving up? Because this is to help move the um dot on the other red dot too. I thought it would have came with one of these, but it didn't. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab a screwdriver for you guys who wanna see if it'll work with a screwdriver, which I'm pretty sure it will, but I'm just a little confused. This is the only one it came with. This is the only one it came with. Hex key, let me make sure it don't say it include that because it said hex key. Oh, I'm tripping. Yo, it's on this. Nah, that's fire. That's fire, cuz. I ain't even say cuz. That's fire. Nah, that's fire. You can turn it with this. <laughs> nah, 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 that's fire, cuz. That's fire. Let me see. You can literally, oh, I dropped it. You can literally turn it with this, dog. So you guys can hear? See if y'all can see in here, hold on. I know it's uncomfortable right now for y'all, but you're literally looking. Man, that's fire. That's fire, dog. And then to keep it locked in a place so where it don't come apart, you just screw it back on. I mean, not come apart, so where it don't lose zero. Just screw it back on. And if I'm not mistaken, that locks it into place. That is fire. That is, I'm not gonna lie, bro. This optic was only 80 bucks, bro. Bro, that is fire. This optic was only 80 bucks. And I was about to get ready to complain, be like, why would you not send that? But I didn't realize the top had the same groove, but in order to like flip it, in order to turn it, so you guys can get a better look at that. See how, yeah, see how it's poking out? That's amazing, bro. Nah, that is, that is fire. I'm not gonna lie. Sorry, y'all did yourself with this one, man. We're gonna go ahead and install it. Okay, so if any of you guys have played Black Ops 1, you know in Black Ops 1, the commando if you're into guns the commando back sight rear sight was backwards the rear sight was backwards so i want to kind of keep that same concept but add like a different one because also i want this to be like a futuristic commando right and on the other ones on on the call of duty black ops if you put a if you put a red dot on it you have no iron sights at all but i want to i want to make like a modern day one so in modern day Obviously, you have a red dot, but what if your battery runs out and you need some extra sights? That's why I got these flip-up sights, but I really don't want to ever have to use them. I want it to be for aesthetic only and to keep that same, like, Black Ops nostalgic feeling. I put the front sight on backwards. As you can see, it looks kind of funny because it touches. Well, it don't really touch it, but you see it's laying forward and it's supposed to be the other way. I got this one the right way, and I'm, I kind of switched it. See what I'm saying? I had the front one backwards and the the back one right. I don't know if that makes sense, but when I do a full build on this, I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys know. But yeah, the red dot is gonna go right here. Once again, I never wanna have to use these. I don't, but I am thinking about taking off this back sight and put the optic back here and just have just the front sight. I'm thinking about doing that because like I said, on the other game, you didn't have no sights. So one site is sufficient, you see what I'm saying? But I don't think you can do stuff like put this on the gun on YouTube no more. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this on. Why are you getting so close to the camera? I don't think that you can put stuff, but I don't think that you can put like attachments and stuff on guns on YouTube no more. So I'm gonna go ahead and equip this and I'll be right back with y'all. I don't wanna get in any trouble. I'm already out of the algorithm. I'm trying to get back, but I might be removing this backside and these work. So good. I love these sites. But I'll be right back. Boy, this red dot turned me every way but loose, boy. Okay, so I got it to work. I had to uh, do a few things to make it work. But not only does she look so good with it on top, but the co-witnessing, oh, it is so perfect, bro. The co-witness is so perfect. But I don't even want to hold y'all no longer, man. This is how she look. Bro, don't she just look goofy bro oh she looks so i can't wait to show y'all how i look with the co-witness but i had to flip my backside 
and I kept the, the front side high. I don't know why my front side not flipping up today. For whatever reason, it's not flipping up today. But I kept it. I, I, I flipped it to how it is in the game. So now it's backwards. Um, but it's it's working. It's perfect, man. But the red dot by itself. Let's get right into that. Look at how she looked on top of the AR. I like that level three. That's up four. I like that. Um, put this mag in right quick. I don't even know you can put mags on and guns on YouTube no more. But look that red dot. Oh man, she looks so good. Let's see if I can get you guys a view of it. You see what I'm saying? Look at how she looks. Oh man, it looks so so good, bro. Y'all want to see the co-witnessing? And you can drop that down, but this is for more precise shooting. With the front one, I don't know why my front one not flipping up like I said. Can I get it? Look at that. Oh my gosh, bro. That is, bro. I'm trying to get it. I'm shaking too much. Look at that. All right. Now let me go ahead. I can drop this. Oh, because it's backwards. I got to do a front one now. I don't like that, but drop that forward. And it opens up the back. Now you guys really going to get that cool with me. Look at that. Oh, I can't get it to focus. See? Look at that. Oh my goodness. Bro, this is perfect. Now I don't really like where the iron sets are at. And also I thought about getting this um this railing to where I can put it right here. And I would have my front side right here. But once again, I'm ma I'm I'm making it to where I never want to have to use these uh, iron sights. But this is the red dot man in all her glory in all her glory man the c i keep saying c the sally t10 man this is her all her glory she looks like an absolute beast man let's see how i look with just the front side i right, flipped up that side that time just the front side co-witness is crazy bro man look at that look at that Oh man, oh, bruh, God is so good. Building on a budget, a $80 AR-15 red dot, 80 bucks, bro, for Amazon Prime, 80. I'm going to the range soon, I'm about to be back shooting, but this is how, man, first impressions. Now, I am gonna give a full review. I love this, I absolutely love this, bro. I can't, I can't hide my excitement right now. I absolutely love this, but, once again, Black Ops Bill. I want to make her like the Commando. So this is basically a reflex sight. This is a reflex sight from Black Ops 1, and she's on that pretty good. First impressions, what do I rate this? Durability-wise, she is sturdy for only 80 bucks. I know people are going to tell me to get the Sig Romeo, and I was going to do that, but once again, they don't have that Shake Awake feature. And I love the Shake Awake feature, man. I'm about to go on Amazon right now and buy these batteries in bulk so I can have them. I'm just excited about this, man. I'm super, super, super excited about this. Now I need to get me a carrying case because I don't think this will fit in my box no more. You have the covering thing to keep it from just getting dirty when it's in the closet, man. Hey, bro, I don't even know what else to say, man. I think y'all see the review. Y'all tell me what y'all think, man. Sally, T10, I gotta remember that. I keep in this a cat, a C. Sally T10, man. This is beautiful, bro. This is what I call quality. 80 bucks, you cannot beat that. You just can't beat it, bro. You just can't beat it. Just for y'all to be on the lookout for the Silent Cap X1. I need y'all to be on the lookout for that. Cause I'm gonna do a full review on it. I have over 500 rounds through this um, red dot. And she's, she's a beauty as well. But man, with that being said, God is amazing. I can't wait to send pictures of this to my partners. God is so, so, so good, bro. We're going to be finished with this build soon. I'm not going to let y'all know everything I'm doing to make it modern. But obviously, if you played the game, you know I'm going to get the sling. I'm going to do all of those things. Um, yeah, man. And after, well, I'm not going to tell y'all what I'm doing. Because I got another gun on the way. You hear me? Got another gun on the way. But with that being said, it feels good to be back to YouTube. Thank you, God. It feels good to be back to YouTube with everything going on. Happy birthday to my brother who passed away, man, El Sosa. I love you, brother. God is amazing. His, his grace is sufficient. But we're going to go ahead and get out of here in prayer. 
Oh, I'm excited. I can probably take this jersey out, bro. We had um favorite team there at church, and it's not my favorite team. Y'all know Lamar Jackson, my favorite football player of all time. You know what I'm saying? Take it. Hey, it is what it is. It is what it is. I'm a, I'm a diehard Saints fan. We just lost to Atlanta today. Atlanta, y'all are dirty birds, but I stay in y'all lane, boy. But we getting back to it. Like I said, God is amazing. <laughs> Dear Heavenly Father, our Father in heaven, we come to you today, God, to simply say thank you, God. Thank you for every single thing it is that you do. We know that you make no mistakes, Father God. We pray that you keep us covered by the blood of your son, God, by the blood of the lamb. We know with you, God, we can do anything. Without you, we can merely do nothing. Nothing is possible without you, God, and we know that. And we're even thankful for that. We're thankful that we need you, Father. We want to need you, Father. We want to be where you are. That's a fact, God. We love you so much for being who you are. I pray, I pray that everybody on the other side of the screen have peace, have prosperity in their life. I pray that you keep them where they need to be. Or, matter of fact, bring them out of where they're at if it's not a good spot. We love you so much, Father God. We know that when it's two or three in the midst, and if all of us have our head bowed right now, have our tongue quiet, we all quiet, we, we silence right now. We know that when it's two or three of us, you're in the midst, God. So thank you for being in the midst. I'm so grateful. I'm so thankful for you, Father God. God bless the soul of Carnell family. I pray that they have peace. We love you, Father. As simple as that. I want to continue to serve you no matter what, Father God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. But that's all, man. Oh, God, it's so good. I hate this backside being like that. Oh, but stop. I hate this backside being like this. I really do. It's so ugly to me. But if it's going to work, it's going to work. And like I said, I'm never going to be using these sites anyway. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm good, bro. But y'all have a blessed day, man. I love y'all. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Help me get back in this algorithm. YouTube ain't trying to help, so I need y'all to help me. God is amazing. I love y'all, and I'm out, bro.